hello, hello, my beautiful boos. I've got a video for you guys today. It's another Halloween video for you guys. I hope you're so excited. I am. Today I'm just going to be doing a little bit of freehand nail art for you guys. Just what comes to my head. I want to do this 10 days of Halloween for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And let's get started. Now today's mani is going to be a gel polish mani today. I'm just going to use gel pro polish in this set. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate my nails, my gel nails, have them ready to apply whenever I um, finish the art on them. So I'm going to draw the art on them first and then cure them on. So, as you can see, these are the gel nails that I got from AliExpress. I've already got them all sized up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a buffer, just like this, and I'm just going to rough up these nails. And that's just going to ensure that the gel polish is going to stick to the surface. I have to say that's one thing that I do like about these nails is that you can decorate them beforehand. Now the only thing is now is that I've never tried to do um, this so it's going to be a little different but I thought why not. Okay so I'm going to start off using this Model 1's Diamond Gel. So I'm actually going to cure this now. Thanks for here. This has got the holographic uh, glitter in it. And I like that it's really spaced out, but I'm going to show you what I'm going to do to it. So I'm going to go ahead and cure this. I'm going to cure this for about 30 to 60 seconds, depending on your lamp. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to feel of it to see if it's lumpy, bumpy. This is actually really good. It's not really that bumpy, but I am going to buff it just a little bit. Not much. I'm just going to take my buffer and just kind of slowly go over it like this. When you're painting, it's better to paint on a complete flat surface or, a, you know, a matte surface. Um, if you're using acrylic paint and things like that, or if you're using gel, it's just easier for the gel to adhere to it and easier for acrylic paint if it's matte. So, finally, it's matte and I'm ready. Okay. So, I'm using my new brush today. I'm super excited. I got my new Robin Moses brush, my favorite nail art brush. Um, I have done wonders since I changed my brush so I really 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 love these brushes
Okay, so now I'm using the Model 1 Clear Poly Gel. We are going to be applying this to the nail. Alright my lovely boo, so this is the final results. 
hope you guys enjoyed it you guys let me know down below if you like it or not I love it I think it turned out super cute but yeah anyways I used the model ones products today don't forget that as well I used their clear in this set Worked out pretty well, actually. I'm not, um, I don't know, I did. I do it really good, you know, because, like, once it start, you start moving around, it gets kind of warm and then it's like it's soft. So it wasn't like a really hard <clears throat> poly gel to push down on the nail. So I really feel like less is more, I guess. But we'll see how long these stay on, if they work really good or not. So. Anyways, guys, I'll leave the link down below for this Model Ones Poly Gel. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Anyways, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys. Excited to see you in the next Halloween video. Anyways, don't forget to share. Don't forget to also hit that notification button so you get all my videos. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye!